Welcome back to Goblin Stone, everybody. Glad folks are into this one. It's been a good time. And I'm getting into uh, some more complicated stuff now, or at least in terms of trying to get the sort of bills that we want to get going. I gotta look for ways to uh, breed our goblins more effectively so we can get better stats on them and uh, be able to utilize these other classes we're coming across here. So that'll be our focus for today. On top of uh, just expanding, adding more goblins to the roster, upgrading the war room or barracks, all kinds of fun stuff to do. Don't think there's any other rooms I need to build right now. I suppose an additional larder could be good, but I feel like I ought to go ahead and save the resources for later, considering how often we've needed more of the building resources later points in the game, so I'm going to go ahead and stockpile those for now. Uh, the barracks is barracks full, I think. A strong legion for many no, it looks like we have four open slots, so let's focus on getting some good breeding going a here. Strong requires a opening up space. Many will be born this better suits their temperament. We can already draw a couple new names for the roster. That's going to be Lenergetic to start us off today. A brand new guard. Ruthless and alert. Off you go. Hell yeah, buddy. And then, as much as I don't want to change the name of Snub Lurker, I, knew, cool. I think we are going to have to do that as well. That's going to be direct to you. Who I think already has a goblin. But I'm alright with doubling up. Alright, oh, yeah, you gotta actually go with that. Suits their I recommend it, actually. Yeah, it's been a good time. Alright, so if we sort by mind, which is the stat that we need for that class, right? I'm just gonna remind myself real quick. Drek 3U, if it's a duplicate, that's a good call. Yeah, we can do that. Um, so. Looking at our peons again, if we want to turn them into a hunter, it's mine. We need six points in mine in order to do that. So if we go to our warrens, we sort by mine. We can see who's got that highest stat right now. It's going to be Drek. And they can't breed with any relatives, so the makings of a look at this instead. So can someone help me out with this? Because clearly you need something higher than five mind in order to get to six mind, which seems like you can't get to six mind unless you have somebody with six mind, but you can't get six mind unless you use somebody with six mind. Like, it's, this just seems insane to me right now. We're still sorted by mind here, right? So, oh, they're retired, I see. Oh no, related, it's just not showing me that anymore for some reason. Then needs new blood. Plus the trait that gives bonus mind. I, gu I guess so, yeah. This pairing holds promise. It just, this, I, am, I, am I alone in feeling as though this is needlessly prohibitive? It shouldn't be this difficult to create a goblin of this class. Am I wrong? Like, it just seems unnecessary. To, to make it this hard to to create a goblin like this. Because I don't think we can. The makings of a strong brood. Two five should have a chance of a six. It just doesn't make a lot of sense to me. This pairing holds promise. So literally the only way to do it is to find a goblin with whatever trait it is that adds to mine. I, I don't think that's good. Needs new blood. I'd go so far as to say that's bad. This pairing holds promise. Um. Well, if that's the case, then needs new blood. I'm just gonna not like. This is where it's gotten me here. Unfortunately, is I don't care enough to try that hard to make the perfect goblin to meet this character class requirement. Having said that, though, it definitely feels like that's just the start of that being the case, and more than likely, Mystic, Hunter, and Bandit are all going to require that same threshold on the different stats. So... Ew, is, is how I feel about that. That just, that just feels icky, and I don't like it. 
prospects loiter about, oh. eager for admittance. Well, there we go. We got the golden goose here in Food Hawker. Okay, so we at least have one with six spirit for now. Let's recruit them and find out who that's going to be. That's going to be Princess Emmy Bear. Welcome to the team. I'm going to go ahead and recruit you. Promising addition. Get you upgraded immediately. Slag sorter. No, that's not it. Who was it? Can you sort these guys by spirit as well? Yeah. Oh, we do have another six spirit one. That's Thoslai. So assuming we combine these two, I imagine we'll probably be able to turn that into somebody pretty decent. Alright, anyway. So yeah, we're going to hold off on that until maybe we have the other uh, classes available. Oh boy, there's a lot of thinking going on here. You gotta keep your best options How open. Best to sort the distinguished from the yeah, five does seem to be the standard. Um, I think I'll take this person as well. Oh, never mind. All right, good enough. Yeah, we don't really need to get anybody that's not uh, specialty focused right now either, I guess. Oh, and then a seven-body dapper. Yeah, all right then. So it's not fully unheard of, I suppose. In fact, if I combine dapper and Dan, I wonder. The makings of a strong brew. I wonder what that would do for us right now. Combine dapper. But Dan needs new blood. With where is he? Where's Dan? He's not in this list. He does not exist in this list, does he? And I wonder why that is. Yeah, he, oh, there he is. Okay, I just didn't see him. This padding holds promise. Why? <laughs> why? Why? Why does this not make seven or six body? I don't get it, man. I am fully at a loss with this system. I don't understand what you want from me. Ah, oh, let's just go on a mission, I guess. This is ridiculous. Jesus Christ. All right, let's see here. We do still thankfully have at least one hunter. Let's go by, can we order them by, we can go by newest, I guess, if we want to get somebody new in the mix. How about this person, who has not been named yet either, and will therefore be named Grimier. Welcome Grimier to the team. Uh, Bearded Goblin. Welcome. How appropriate. Back. 67 months on the file, welcome back in. Give him some bear hugs, please, for the resub. The game shows you the base stats equal 5, but the brute modifier gives plus 2, so all in all it's 7. So it's simply due to the fact that the predicted spawn did not have the brute modifier, which again doesn't make a ton of sense, because why wouldn't it if the, if the parent has it? It's just weird, man. That part of the game has been pretty frustrating for me. Alright, let's get him some magic rocks. You got your twig there. Drek's going to need a stone. Dunk, you're going to need something there. You got a pretty nice weapon for you, in fact. You have a long stick. They had brew, but it wasn't showing the changes to the stats in the preview. Okay, so if we did make them offspring, though, we might actually be able to get the brute, stat, brute thing from that. It wasn't showing... Oh, it, yeah, okay, it actually had it. Okay, okay, so I'll, I'll go look at that again afterward then. Uh, actually, let's go do it right now, because I need to buy a stool anyway. So hopefully this will work. The makings of a strong brood. It does all have brood. Okay, okay, okay. But this one is religious, but it doesn't necessarily have to be religious. Okay. Huh. Weird. Whatever. Let's try it. One teams with new life. Okay, please. Yes, good, good. Okay, we have some warriors ready to go. Seven body, thank goodness. We're, we're figuring it out, slowly but surely. And now, let's go buy another stool. They're dumb as hell, yeah, that, that, ain't, that ain't a problem, though. 
that we can live with. Oh boy, okay, here we go, I'm ready. Now I feel better, now I feel like we're onto something. Give you your stool, party har har. All right, send it, man. Let's go. Let's do some good out here. Let's let's get our spirits back. I'm ready. Three shaman squad. No raiders this time around. I wonder how this is gonna go. This is a different kind of build for us. I kinda wanna put the hunter like right here though. I wonder if I can switch that around real fast. There we go. That feels better. Oh, new Gabo, too. Oh, please give me another hunter. Or a raider. Nah, that's not what we need. Oh, eight body on this guy, though. Interesting. Six spirit. That works for me, dude. Let's grab him. Send him home. Okay. Off you go, bump yanker. God, a lot of the difficult names I'm struggling to want to change. Because they are just outstanding by default. I'm going to turn the audio down just a smidge here, too, by the way. Sorry. There we go. Oh, yeah, why not? Ooh, a primitive wand with bonus damage versus beasts and gain five life per attack. Let's do it. Fine. Oh, bold. no, 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 no. Ah, why did I do that? I let myself get ambushed. I wanted to equip my new weapon. Welcome back. Jagged Jackal. Thank you for the 75. Thank you for the prime sub. Welcome on back into the pile. Give him some bear hugs, please. Appreciate it. We are going to boost up the speed on Dunk. Who has a mortal wound? Wait, what? Why? Did you start with this? Well, that sucks. I didn't realize that was happening. Okay. It should have, like, some kind of indicator of that as you're going. I, I, you would think it would say something like, hey, are you sure you want to bring these people out? They have mortal wounds. I don't think there was any indication of that to begin with. Okay, let's see. We're gonna go ahead and spirit rush on the guard. Seems like a good idea. Okay, I like that. All right, Craig, you're gonna armor it up, buddy. That's been serving us well. I gotta get something done here, though. Rattle. Stun him up. What's a baby goblin called? A gabo. Or a goober. Yeah, let's see. How are we doing on an intercept? That would be helpful. Let's do it. Oh, goblet is also good, yeah. Dunk, buddy. I don't know how this happened, man. Goodness, our damage is pitiful, too. Oh boy, yeah, he's, he's done. See ya. I was fond of that one. See, I wouldn't have brought him out. If I knew he had a mortal wound. Sure, would have been great to know. Oh well. And sadly, we can't just replace him with that new guy we found earlier either. That would have been nice. Yeah, keep that armor up, I guess. Mm, spirit rush for the guards one more time. Yeah. The only way we're able to get through this. Let's see, Dung Trap's gonna go pretty well here. What do you got, buddy? Life Shock. I don't even know if that's really gonna matter all that much. I think we're probably better off just going all in here. I yeah yeah I I I hesitate to even indulge myself in wanting to. Like effect, I, I feel like I'm whining too much in this playthrough, I'm not going to lie, but I do think the majority of my complaints are justified. This UI has some issues. Let's, let's flat out. The, 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 the user interface in this game is not fantastic. Like The, the, the lists are far too uh, difficult to parse. 
Uh, they seem to, like, reorder themselves flippantly, which is very strange. This is good. The combat UI is great. Like, this, this all works very well and is operating as intended. I think most of my issues have to do with, like, the XCOM elements of this game, which are just not really perfectly explained. The breeding, obviously, I've been having a lot of confusion with. It could use some improvement, but there's so much good here that it is outweighing the bad by quite a bit. Like, I can, I can gush about the good parts of this game for way longer than I can complain about the things that are frustrating. Yeah, I wouldn't mind some quality of life changes, though. I would appreciate... Uh, well, right out of the gate, I would just say I'd appreciate just being able to have a little bit more clarity on the breeding and, like, what will work better there. I mean, honestly, I could just... I, I'd appreciate just, like, a tool tip. Just, like, a little window popping up and saying, like, you'd, you'd have better results if you were to breed X and Y pair or something like that, you know? Anyway. Hopefully we don't lose another gobbo here, but I'm not banking on it. Direct's in pretty bad shape, so is Craig. Let's go for the knockback again, I guess. Got him tired. That's pretty good. You get 13 damage here. Kind of doubt it. Not slow either. All right, can we intercept? We can salvage. That's not going to be much, though. It's only healing for three, so let's try to stun again, I guess. Can you flee the mission if you win this fight? Sure. Maybe. I should look. And we can't pass turn. We can't flee combat either, so, yeah. It's going to be that or nothing. Also, nerf. Oh, grim buddy. I certainly don't want to lose you in your very first combat here, huh? Let's see. Is this going to get the kill? Not quite, so... This will just keep hitting him with the soul gale for one damage a pop. Jesus. Yeah, now we got to get the kill here. Gotta be. All right, guys, come on now. We can do this. We can do this. Heal for 18. Full HP, brother. And then rattle him up again. No stun that time. Does attack there, got the arm. That's ideal. Hopefully intercept this time. Don't let Drek die. Thank you very much. All right. After that, I think we're going to be okay, so long as they don't attack again, because once they attack again, we're absolutely fucked. There we go. Hope I'm not to get the bear optimal on that. Okay. Squeaking by still here, man. Squeaking by. Clearly, it is uh, much more difficult to... Get through these areas now. I really ought to not be taking the elite combat either. I, I think I just realized that was entirely of my own volition that I decided to go up against the more difficult enemy in here. And that clearly wasn't a great idea. Grim, buddy, don't go. Don't go. Not yet. Oh my god, everybody's dying, dude. 10 HP. 10 HP worth of damage. Where are we going to find it? Before bleeding out. There it is. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Yeah, this is bad. I don't think there's a retreat option. Abandon. All gathered loot will be lost permanently. Yeah, honestly, it might just be better to let them die. Weirdly, that's... I think the best choice for us is to just get the souls from sacrificing these dudes. As much as I don't want to uh, lose them, it might just have to be the play here. Five life per attack is excellent, though. Maybe we have a chance. Let's try that for Paragon. And then let's go with the uh, damage versus beasts here as well. There you go, buddy. Might as well take what little heals I've got. All right, here we go. Gobbos are expendable. Yeah, it's not a big deal. Not the worst thing in the world. Let's see if I can ambush this guy. Feels like it's probably going to be a very similar fight here, though. Yeah, 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 all right. 
likely to see a full wipe here. We'll do our best. We'll treat this with a newfound respect, at least. I recognize that we're going to need some pretty effective team comps to make it any further now. That was pretty effective. God damn, good stuff, dude. Web's going to get him poisoned again, so yeah, they're in pretty rough shape. Do I even dare? Let's do it, yeah. I'll take what I can get, I guess. Well, I'm pretty sure we're all dead. Yeah, that poison's too much, man. That poison's way too much. See you, Grim. We hardly knew you. God damn, five and four poison is outrageous. Toast. Poor fellers. We get one. We brought one down with us. Maybe he'll solo it. He's effectively our flagellin here with that heal on attack. Oh, if only we could have gotten him the uh, the haste. Anybody who dies gets banned. Yeah, that's that's your new shtick now, right? Okay, so let me get down to it. Is there, is there even, like, a way? Is there a chance? Do I dare hope? Probably not, but... I've been inappropriately confident in the past. Uh, bash him. Oh, boy. Battered and in dire condition. Yeah. Yeah. There may yet be hope. Really? <laughs> that's what that's what procked that line? If you say so. Eh, freeze him, why not? Two down! Oh shit! Numbers! Still living! Almost grievous move. And a howl? Okay. Let's stun him, dude. Maybe we can do something. I doubt it, but... Yeah, never mind. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, sheesh. Uh, yeah, stun him, I guess. Bonk. There's another plus five. He's still living. He's still kicking. It's, it's the solo play, dude. It's straight up just a solo flagellant action. There has gotta be it. Jack of all spades. Welcome. Thank you very much for the seven months on the pile. Welcome on back in. Bear hugs, please. That madman, he actually did it. <laughs> yeah, I can appreciate the seven. Thank you. Welcome back in. Yeah, the default timeout is pretty long. Like slash timeout and then the length of time in seconds will let you specify it a little more. Is he actually? Nope. No, he's not. I was. I just had to it say something. Back. Okay, cool. Think nothing more of it. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. All it is is six free souls for bear. Whole bunch. All right. All good. All good. Feels like they're just toying with the last one. Yeah, they're playing with their food. Day doors. Righto. We've upgraded our ancestors' hall. Level three. Sweet. Let's grab that new Gabo, whichever one was the good one. It might already be in the barracks, actually. A proper barracks can fuel a strong legion for many generations. Okay. We got names. Get your pick me in if you haven't done so already. If you'd like to join the squad here. We're going to rename Bumpy Anchor to begin with, and then... Probably need well. We need a fresh six, don't we? Yeah, we need a brand new squad here in the war room. Let's put them together. Don't have any hunters anymore. Let's do a couple of guards up front. Let's go with Dan. Let's go with Glenn. Get some raiders in there. Do standard fare, and then I'll Ryan and Drek. Yeah, it's gonna be good enough. Good enough selection. The gobbos themselves don't seem to level up in any way, no. It's mostly the equipment that's 
aiding them. All right. At least one name to draw here, right? Oh, no, not with the new guys, but with the barracks at the very least. This is going to be... Do, 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 do. Johnny Blackred. Welcome to the squad. We'll, uh, we'll probably get you in the mix soon, in fact. One of these days we'll find another hunter. And then, for you, that's gonna be a sorcerer. Well, I think I have a good idea of the direction we want to take you. Ah, yeah, that's the one role that you can't do, unfortunately. Oh, well. Hey, look, I spelled it right this time. All righty. Not a lot else to be done this time around. Again, we're still not really building anything in particular here. Not really looking to get another larder. A strong lair requires a hardy lineage. Oh, we could, Any yeah, we could upgrade before. these guys as well. Although I kind of want to wait until maybe we're able to do the bandit, because I assume that these guys are going to be able to be bandits as well. But I don't know when we have that opportunity. I assume I probably have to get to level four ancestors hall. I might even also have to do this. Welcome back. Hey, Kurgo. Uh, part management, part Darkest Dungeon-esque dungeon crawling and combat. So it's like a mix of Darkest Dungeon and XCOM. It's been the most convenient way to explain it. Kadustus! Almost a year to 22 months on the pile. Welcome back in. Thank you very much for the resubscription. Give us more bear hugs, please. Thank you. Requires 35 souls and 26 goblins. That's a lot. Okay. So it might be a minute before we get that other haul, unfortunately. But I do think I should wait still on that. I need to get more folks to retire. Which they do that on their own, right? Tranquil home for goblins in the twilight of their lives. Yeah, I think they I think they just automatically send themselves here. I'm gonna upgrade this thing as well. It seems worthwhile. I do have to do it with her, okay. I know I've been been doing that, but I assumed that after a while they would probably do it on their own. Sword by... Why does this not work? <laughs> so many weird things with the UI, dude. That just straight up doesn't sort the way it should. Um, let's see here. Tiring requires quarters. Oh, the quarters aren't available right now because they're in a construction to improve them. I see. Okay, okay. Um. Well, in that case, since none of these guys are particularly noteworthy, only the keen and eager are welcome. Right? Yeah. There's never really anything fantastic in, in their traits. I guess we're just heading out again. We do need to clear this eventually, so hopefully today's going to be the day. Let's go rescue the orcs and not die in the process, ideally. Some decent weapons. Get you sorted here. Oh, I should check the merchant first, actually, just in case the merchant has a better weapon available, too, because every now and then he's got the green weapons. That could be nice. He's got a green stool. Let's take it. And possibly even the rock on a stick. Oh, the large bone is much stronger, but does require a bandit. Long stick is exclusive to spear, or hunter, that rather. Okay. Bargain. That'll do. Mm -hmm. Okay, we can go ahead and wield this better stool real quick. Nice. The damage versus beast, which is really, really good for where we're going. Where we're going, we're gonna see lots of beasts. These guys equipped, all set to go. Get yourself some magic sticks and magic twigs. Slash rock slash twigs. Send it. Send it. I believe. I've gotta believe. I gotta feel like we can do this. It's taking a step up in difficulty in the hinterlands, man. I'm, I gotta be ready for it.
be nice if we could bring money. Or not money. Well, money, too, actually. But uh, food is what I meant to say. Some supplies. Proper Darkest Dungeon style. Ooh, this is great to see, though. Potential is nothing without practice. This we very much like to see. So, haste and inspire. Next ability costs one less time unit. Ooh, tempting. The life shock upgrade is huge, though. Hmm. An improvement. I might even take that again if they give me the opportunity. Ooh, soul gale is going to add more damage and more chance to knock back. Oh, the armor up, Bill. Ah, oh, boy, yeah. Makes the Those are safety plays, and I think that is a good idea. Ooh, yeah, and then Life Shock 3. Heals for 75% of your power plus spirit. Nice. Uh, improved. Life Shock just got a huge bonus. Okay, heavily defensive with the upgrade choice, but I think, I think that will be for the best. Here we go. Let's do it. Defensive. Armor time. And we're going to be healing all day. Ain't afraid to pop the life's uh, whatever it is. And then also, got some proper damage in the form of the raiders again, too. Owie. Let's see, you got bleed going? There we go. Get those wounds. I'm tempted to go with, like, a full Raider build one time, just to see if, like, just going all in on the damage might be something. Oh, excellent. Ooh, got the slow from that, too. That was fantastic. That was a great soul gale. Now, do I want to just go ahead and heal him up? I did say I was going to do that, but I could also blast. They're already slow, so yeah, this is a good idea. Frozen as well. Sick. Especially to be frozen in the third rank. It was going to be a full effect there. Uh, rattle. It's the full control game, baby. Can't ever get hit if they never take an action. Stun him up. 12 damage. Let's go. My goodness. This is awesome. Going very well so far. It's like DD1 all over again. No kidding. Yeah. Dapper's still in rough shape, though. They're probably gonna need a heal soon. Exterminate. See ya. One down. Okay, we're healing that boy up. Heals for 10 now. Outstanding. That is so nice. That's Soul Gale again. Hot damn, dude. Look at him go. Rattle for the stun, sure. I'm loving it. This is what we need to be doing now. These are the kinds of plays we need to make if we're gonna be making it through this area. Dapper, how about a wakey wakey buddy? Or a chop might be better. Yeah, let's do that. Sundered. Oh, yeah, the Gabos are a lot more expensive than like a typical Darkest Dungeon hero. That is certainly a difference in this game, is that, weirdly, sometimes you even want your goblins to die. In a situation like we're in, for example, where we have an abundance of decent goblins, nobody, like, particularly good, lots of classes that we can easily uh, replenish, or replace, rather. So... I don't have a huge issue with um with losing a few to get some bonus souls. And get progress made elsewhere. The stuns and the bleeds, man, it's all going good. Wakey wakey back there, and we try the exterminate? Nah, that's not all that great. Let's chop him up again. The armor on Dan has been outstanding. Let's go ahead and stay with that. Somehow keeps ending up at the front, man. Sheesh. Let's keep happening to you, man. Get out of there. I'm gonna heal him up. Dan could intercept as well, although nobody's actually targeting him, and he's getting targeted there. Bash isn't gonna be that good either, so this seems right. Okay. Fine with that. 
pick the wounds again, absolutely. He's having a bad time, dude. Oh, I think three stacks of bleed is the most he can do? Or does pick wounds not actually add a stack? It adds another and then refreshes. Yeah, so I guess three is the max. Interesting. Um, yeah, right there. All right, then. Dying is an important part of evolution. True that. Survival of the fittest. Breeding down to the very best gobos. Yeah, let's see here. He's probably dead to the bleed anyway. I don't think really need to do much about that. A bold attack. One damage. Oh, this poor guy. Yeah, he is. He's having a bad day. Even with the power up, he's uh, he's earning a lot. Loving the armor situation on our squad, man. This actually feels like one of the better teams we've had in a minute. And I appreciate that a lot. I needed it. All right, we got a lot to take him out here. I'm gonna go salvage that and heal him back up to full. Hell yeah. Hope we get another life shock on, uh, who was it? Dapper Dogman, right? Yeah, he needs it, but sadly not lucky there. Oh well, pretty good start. That feels a lot better than the last time, certainly. They advance their call. Forty gold. And what do we got here? Speed plus thirty percent. And a wooden sword with a chance to slow. Nice. A respectable hole. Nice. Let's see here. Give this to. Let's give this to Dapper, since he doesn't actually have any other slots available. And speed seems like it would be best on a Shaman. Okay. That all looks pretty good. Same either way, but we can check the map to see what's coming up after. And I think I'd rather get the loot, so yeah, we'll go up. Hopefully I can find some food in the chest here. More than welcome. Oh, it's a slime fight. Nice. These are much easier in my experience. As long as we can focus them early. Oh, right. He's the Wait, does he still have the... Is that the orb that we had before for him? Can we see that now? I don't know if I can actually look at that to see if he's got the orb that's healing him for five. I thought it was just a temporary one. I could have sworn that was just something we had for the previous run. Maybe I'm getting mixed up. All right, can we kill the skull early? Oh, Dapper, buddy. Dapper, you're in trouble, man. Can we get the life shock? No, we cannot. Shit. Doesn't want to give me that here. We need some love. We need some life shock in there. We go. That's better. Crit for 15 healed. Jeez, that's nice. That'll be intercepting a little more here too, I guess. Yeah, we can't control that. So let's do exactly that. Be healed again. Huh. Is that something else that's doing that for him? That's confusing. <laughs> Have you used a redraw once in this game? It doesn't seem to always be available. I don't know what dictates that either. Whether or not they have a redraw. I guess I could do that now, actually. Yeah, I should. Absolutely should do that. That's a good point, because then I got to crit for 16 heals on Drek. Their mind stat has to be five. Oh, okay, okay. Interesting. Exterminate. Every five mind equals one redraw. Oh, is he can more than one? Interesting. I'm looking forward to uh, what I anticipate is going to be a point at which the ability to get higher base statistics should be a lot more doable for us. Should open up some options. Hoping to sneak in some more heals here as well. Like that you say that as if it's going to be common to have 10 plus of a stat. Yeah, that's kind of what I'm getting at. It's like, oh, hopefully that'll be relevant at some point because right now it doesn't really seem like it's going to matter at all. 
Hell, getting five mines seems uncommon at this point. Alright, well, life shock upgrades have obviously been doing work for us here, and hopefully we can find another one with this guy. There we go. Back to full, sheesh. Let's see if I can sneak in a little bit more, actually. Might be an interceptor salvage here. Armor up works, too. Armor up or salvage, armor up or salvage, there we go. Bounce back and forth, I guess, which is probably going to result in the same kind of things anyway, so that works. Come on, shamans. Come on, shamans. Get on up there. When you all got the speed buff, man, get, get, get quick with it. Zoom on up here, buddy. Slice and deck for the bleed works. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised that even is an option against these guys. There we go, nice. Okay, armor up. Really would love to see a salvage there. Uh, pick, eh, it's all going to kill. All right, fine. That was a pretty good finish anyway. Got into pretty good shape at the end of that. Summoning their fortitude, they move on. Cool. Okay, does not look like there's anything else to loot. Off we go. The soundtrack is terrific. Imbued bone. Plus 50% damage versus beasts. Blast. Nice. And plus five armor. Hell yeah. A modest fortune. Hey, Nexus, welcome. Let's do this for Orion. Small power upgrade there. Let's we'll go ahead and give the armor to one of these guys. Sick. Yeah, definitely need that help here. I don't, I don't really want to hang on to that stuff. Oh, and the healing food. Yay, 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 yay. Yeah, this is precious now. I'm going to need to value this stuff a lot more. All right. Hang on to that for now. Cool. All right. Back-to-back -back fights here, unfortunately. I'm going to scoot her this time. Yeah, you can save the orbs for future runs, which is not something I've been doing very frequently. But it is indeed an option. Although I think that would mean we'd probably need to build another armory so we could have more space for that kind of stuff, too. Wakey-wakey. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Drex still needs a little bit of healing done. The slash. Got a life shock, buddy? Yes, you do. Yes, you do. All right. I'm going to try for the uh, spirit rush this time. Let's see if I can get some more. Well... Is that really necessary here? I can blast. Yeah, it's worth with you. Yeah, I'm liking double shield. This has been, I think this is kind of like my standard build right now. Two raiders, two guards, two shamans. 55 fries, 55 shakes, 55 pies. I think it's going pretty well. Balanced. Covers all covers all our bases. It feels like uh, the usual suspects composition. Gets everything we need. What kind of builds y'all been rocking? Because I am tempted, like I mentioned earlier, I think I want to go for like a full Raider build just to see if going all in on the offense might actually be an option. Same with maybe like full Shaman build could be fun. I think this probably do it. Mm -hmm. I said I was going to keep it topped off. I'm going to be a, a bear of my word, finally. It limits you to just three of one type. Ah, shucks. Oh, uh, well. Triple Raider, Triple Shaman, maybe? It seems pretty offensive-minded. All Hunters would be a great way to dispose of your high stack goblins. Yeah, I don't want, to, don't want any of those guys to stick around, right? I think above five, get it out of here. All right. Might try to sneak in another heal here, but 
kind of doubt it. Salvage? Salvage? Redraw? Salvage! Oh, I don't have any of those shit. Oh, well. Oh, well. Goblins are the very embodiment of survival. Amen, brother. Pop a couple heals real quick here. Right there and right there. Very nice. All better. Squirrel! Um, let's go up. Up has mining, down has shop. And then also a shrine at the end. Hmm. Yeah, let's do that. Seems better. Are hunters the new Hellion? They die as soon as Bear deploys them. Anything in this game, the Hellion did. Fine baubles. They're all getting sent to the slaughter. What a colorful squad. Ow. Okay, we're gonna intercept right away, I think. Yeah, intercept on Orion here. Keep the damage on the guards. Same with this, right? Yeah, let's protect Drek again. No, let's actually, let's protect the uh, Canadian here. There we go. Armor up. Oh, okay. That's surprising. Sunder the boy. Dapper. Hit him with a wakey. Let's actually go with a slash here. They do actually have bleed vulnerability, which is continually surprising to me. Last might do it. That's a big damage, actually. Okay, that's worthwhile. Got the intercept. Very nice. Did you targeting that guy with the intercept cause him to bleed? Did it? That'd be sick. Wasn't paying enough attention. That might have been the case. Okay, a little bit of poison. Guards are doing well here. Let's uh, let's rattle them up. Nice stun. Okay. And then salvage not gonna do much. Go ahead and bash this boy. He does bleed. Okay, apparently Len has bleed on attack from something. I gotta pay more attention to this stuff, dude. That's pretty awesome. No idea why that's happening now. Blast. It must be a weapon gem, yeah. Well, that's clutch, too. It goes ahead and just wastes a turn for me there. I think we got this, man. This is going really well. Slow off the attack, too. Holy shit. I should have healed. Yeah, absolutely. I don't know why I didn't heal there. That was a golden opportunity. But we don't really need it, actually. Yeah, we're doing fine. I'm crushing it right now. I'd love to get one in. I'd love to get one little sneaky heal at the end, maybe. But I'm not going to have it. That's all right. That'll do. Modest victories lead to great accomplishments. Okay, just taking a peek here. It was Len, right? Whoa, shit, dude. This stool has a 20% chance to bleed on hit. I had no idea. And then I'm pretty sure one of these guys has the twig that has a chance to slow as well. Oh, no, it's just damage versus beasts. This one has the chance to slow. Yeah, the wooden sword. Cool. That's dope. We got some really good gear on this team. No wonder they're doing so good. Hate it when my stools cause me to bleed. Plus two. Hey, Rock. An intriguing selection. Oh, baby. Intriguing indeed. All that he is a single unit of wood. I'm gonna take all these orbs and all the food. You can have that. This. All that junk. We're gonna make money off the deal, dude. Look at us go. Just what's needed. Sick. They can carry no more. Look at that shopkeeper with his 10 out of 10 hairstyle. I do love the here. pigtails 
on the orcs. That is that is an excellent feature of this game. There, Taffy approved. Hey, X. All right, what do we get here? This statue tenders a strange Right. Gift. Right, right, right. This is the permanent one, isn't it? Let's get damn buff the hell up, dude. Here is power, but it is enough. Success. Their power grows. One more. One more. Still favorable odds, right? A little bear luck? A little bear luck for another plus six max life on Dan? Come on now. Imbued nice with thin magic. But this is the one that I really want to try. I got to do it one time, right? I'm the streamer. I have to do it because I'm the streamer. So we got to roll the dice, but we need a lot of bear luck here. We're going to need all the bear luck. We're going to need everybody in the chat right now to type a bear luck emote in the chat right now for the 46% chance of Dan gaining plus 9 HP. But if I lose, he dies. He's going to die. Oh, boy. Come on, come on, come on, man. One time with it. One time with it. Don't put this responsibility on us. I need a scapegoat. Here we go. No, Dan! Oh, God. Such power was too much to bear. This one is lost. Homie just ran away. <laughs> Straight up bounced. All right. So be it. That's what we deserve. <laughs> I really like that he just, just bolts. That's funny. Well, they're all pretty pissed off as a result, so that's cool. I'll take that side benefit. Yeah, definitely not worth the risk. But we had to we had to chance it once, right? We had to give it a try. Thankfully, I don't think Dan had the bleed stool. I'm pretty sure that was the, God, the phrasing. It's unfortunate. <laughs> Thankfully, I don't think he was the one with the bloody stool. I think that was the other one, so we're good to go there. Dan is in a better place away from Bear. Yeah, you're not wrong. Certainly a lot safer now. <laughs> I don't worry about it, Jax. I think you're, you're probably better off. Mmm, rattle. Oh, no, just bash him. Yeah, there you go. There's that bear cloak command when you need it. I, I, I'm going to add that eventually. Yeah, I just need to find the right bot for it. Doesn't Apollo have that? I'll just ask him. Welcome back. I think it might be a night bot thing. Ruin me pose! Bear hugs for him, please. Thanks for the prime. Welcome on back into the pile. Appreciate it. For 18 months. That'll do. Double kill. An unpleasant encounter. Mm -hmm. But a necessary one. Okay. Let's see here. Let's get healed up a little bit. I am going to save those orbs for next time. I don't think we necessarily need the help, and I think we're even pretty close to the end of this. And if we die, we die. Not a big deal. If he dies, he dies. Mm -hmm. Something of worth in an unlikely place. Mm -hmm. Lots and lots of goodies right away. Oh, but I need the space. Auto auto stack stuff, game. What they are you doing? Patience is bitter. But it's fruit. No, I lost the wood, didn't I? Because I clicked out of the window. No. Oh, God. Dang it, man. Bear throw. Oh well. Let's do camp the at the very least. Fight for the weary. Each party member's power is increased by two. They repose is for the nuts. by the warm flame. Can't the corrupted gabos come back as mini bosses, or am I misremembering something? I hope so. That'd be fun. Then we have to kill Dan. I wouldn't feel all that great about it, but then again, I also kind of would. No offense, Dan. Should be a fun fight, is all. 
they stuff their packs. Also, I have a personal vendetta against you, but let's not get into that. That's neither here nor there. It's over there. All right, yeah, I've been looking for this dude the whole damn time. Let's go. Sounds like zombos. Sounds like we found the zombie horde. <laughs> Hell yeah, brother. Beat his ass. That's an orc? Yeah, can't you tell he's got the pigtails? The telltale sign of an orc. Oh, the halfling fortress, I think. We got orcs versus zombies in the back. Okay, okay. Let's see, how we doing here? Everybody's going for Len. It works for me. Chop for the Sunder. Love that damage, dude. Love that damage. One down. Encouraging progression. Mm -hmm. Sticky hoodoo. Let's do a blast. Yeah, that's some serious damage, dude. Mm-hmm. Oh, total of 16 across the board from the Soul Gale? The power-up is noticeable. I am digging it. Uh, this is like the wolves, though. The longer the fight goes, the worse it is for us. i to try to make this quick. That's a nice stun. That helps a lot. Let's get this guy bleeding, possibly. That's a big damage, dude. I'm going to hit him with the freaking... Gale again if I can, although the blast is pretty nice too. Yeah. One down. I think I'm probably done with XCON 2 yeah, I think I got my fill of that one. It was a good time when we did it though. Is that team working on anything? I haven't thought about them for a minute. Oh, they're just making a third, that makes sense, yeah. Venture a guess, Bear. What the x team's working on. Ow! Yeah, that's what we're worried about with the Zombos. Oh, my gosh. Alright, there you go, buddy. Didn't they basically say there wasn't going to be an XCOM 3? Let's find out. Google XCOM 3. Any updates on XCOM 3? Nope. It's a dating sim now, says the top reply to the Reddit post. Okay, so nobody knows anything, is what that means. Vile cretins. Sweet. Yeah, I'd be all about an XCOM 3D, but... Whatever they want to do. They did that other XCOM game that was a different type of game. I feel like I have a vague memory of that. Okay. Oh, Chimera Squad. Right, right, right. Yeah, now I remember. Oh, shit. Special Zombo. That's a ghoul. Oh, damn. Okay. Okay, okay. That beat was fire, brother. Yeah, I can help myself. Let's see. God, this... Flies buzzing and these are still so loud, dude. It's so distracting. That is a lot of HP on that, dude. Oh, shit. Let's see. Soul Gale is pretty good still. Especially when it knocks back. Outstanding. Ooh, yikes. Frozen Dapper. And then the groans are going to be problematic to here, probably. Yeah. Block at least. Okay. Fully blocking. Good shit. All right, that hurts. Let's slow these guys down, dude. They're speedy. Although, I could probably get a kill with the blast. I got lucky. Yeah, that's good damage. Spread it all around, baby. 
Everybody gets a bit. Stun the ghoul, nice. Wakey wakey? Sure. Oh, nice one. 19 damage. God damn. Good stuff. Spread it all around. Uh-oh. Dapper? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. That was dumb. Hmm. Well, might as well get the max damage, right? Hitting hard. I still might keep him alive. That wasn't great. Oh, I don't get the heal either. All right, slow gale it is. Good stuff. I think we're going to be able to kill this guy prior to his action as well. Let's do it. I do think it is actually, like, compounded by additional ghouls as well, or, or additional zombies, rather, which is very funny. Yeah, it gets quieter the less zombies there are. That's really funny. <laughs> you would think they would have accounted for that. Oh, well. Holy, nice one. Nice one. All right, let's try to get in some heals at the end here, although it's not going to give it to me, is it? Haste on Orion, and hopefully we can find one. Uh, salvage ain't going to do it. But the Immersion Bear. There's an argument to be made there, right? Sure. All intentional. A galvanizing victory. After the failure of Midnight Suns, most of the head folks from the XCOM days are gone. Oh, really? I didn't realize that. Damn. Dude, that... How the... What? The failure? Hold on a fucking second. How many units did this sell? Because it's got like 12,000 Steam reviews. Midnight Suns... What's that? Isn't there like a website where you can see like the amount of units they moved? Or is that... Does that only show the concurrent players now? They can carry no more. That might have been the one where Steam like blocked them from getting on the game before. They can a respectable hole. Rip this orc. Do I need to heal? Kind of need to heal, don't I? Oh yeah, big time. And boom, there we go. They can carry no more. Mm hmm. I mean, just based on the Steam page, it looks like that game sold quite a few units, so it's, it's surprising to hear. My expectations must have been through the roof. That's the shocking part about it, too. Yeah, idea the fact that all it took was a bad performance on a Marvel game to sink the studio. That's, that's scary, dude. We've talked about this a few times, but, like, the games industry is so volatile. You can be on top of the world and then, like, release one bad game and you're just completely screwed. All right, well, we lived. Hooray. That wasn't a given. Let's see what the new day brings. Hoorah. Find the warden of the prison camp so he may answer for his crimes against the orcs. Can do. You know, we're still a ways away from upgrading the war room in the ancestors hall, though. I am curious if this might allow us to get to the new, um, oh, of course, it's the goddamn again dude how much wood do we got how much we got where can we even see that actually there's another UI thing I'd really liked is if they actually showed me the resources I have available I'm not sure if there's even a way to do that right now they would know there must be a screen somewhere where I can see what we've got yeah the merch is not selling any either you got anything for you? Yeah, I got a couple things. There you go, buddy. A fair trade. Do, 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 do. Well, I can see in this screen, I guess, that I apparently only have eight wood, which is really unfortunate. Huh. Are we in this position again? Because this would be very frustrating as we, we straight up are just like relying on the game to randomly provide us with the wood that we need to make progress. The bear grows. 
Upgrading quarters at least. Goblins in the twilight of their lives. That's nice. We get some more souls going now. A proper barracks can fuel a strong legion for many generations. Yeah, let's see about maybe sending him some vets off to retire. He's good for one. He's good for two. He's good for two. How close are we to this? We need like 26, right? I think more than that, actually. Yeah, we need 35 souls. What the fuck, dude? Yeah, I don't think there's any way to show the resources on this screen. I don't know why. That's why I always buy out the materials in the shops. Yeah, even then, though, it's like they very rarely will actually offer what you need there, too. Okay. Anyway. Do we have barrack space? A I know I wanted to wait on these guys. That's right. That's right. Just in case we're able to get there. So, let's take a look at the world map again and see if there's maybe anywhere. I might even go back to the old woods, honestly, and see if there's maybe just a way I can get some wood there. Yeah, let's just go back to the old woods and see if there's a quick way to do that. That is bone, bone, not wood, not wood. Just, just make it, design the game so that all of the resources pop up as available rewards at this point. Am I wrong? Especially <laughs> if you're in a situation like I am, where you only need one thing to proceed. Like, come on, dude. Come on, dude. We need some help here. This is absurd. Whatever. Let's just go fight the warden. I might as well, I guess. Ugh. Let's see. I think I'm gonna do triple raider this time just to just to frick around. Frick around and find out. Get some more firepower in there. What do we need to proceed? We need 20-ish souls. 20-ish goblin souls, but more specifically, I think what we're gonna need to proceed the way I want to right now is the wood. So we can uh get the what's it called? The bandits guild? The Bandit Guild and the other guild that I don't have yet, the, the last class that I've yet to unlock. All right, let's see here. Uh, I, think I've, I don't think I've up to you yet, Ace. Yeah, I'm still waiting to uh, get those other guilds, hopefully. Even though I'm not even honestly sure if that's going to happen here either. That's the other frustrating element. It's like, I don't know if that's going to happen. I don't know if that uh, unlock is, is gated behind that uh, upgrade. All right, we have weapons. I think we're good here. Give me the magical rock with the slow chance. Okay, okay. Is this good? Oh, Ryan's worth three souls. Damn, that's nice. I guess we just send it. Let's do it. Oh, no, 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 hold on. You need... Oh, I think I need to buy another weapon, don't I? Yeah, real quick. Real quick, let's go buy another weapon for the raider. Hit the merchant real fast. Let's see what you got. You're going to give me a rock on a stick. That'll work. That'll work. God. <laughs> Frustrating, man. I want to love this game, but there's so many tiny little things like that that are so annoying. Oh, my goodness. Sell a weapon or something? Just, why does there need to be all this little minutia that you have to adjust with? Okay, get rid of this guy. Pick up a rock on a stick. Just talk There we go. World map again. Get in there. Get to this. And boom. And then dapper. Get your new weapon. There we go. Okay. Send it. Let's kill ourselves a, a, a warden. That's it. The goblins hasten to the camp to search for survivors. Okay. 
the goblins oh. rushed to oh, the no. of a young orc, buried in the wreckage of his own prison, too weak to escape. That's so sad. They struggled to help the orc from the rubble. Determined to accord him a breath of free air to ease his suffering. Oh, there we go. That'll help. At the sound of their harried summons, the old orc assists in freeing his trapped kinsfolk. The goblins are left bereft at the sight of the young orc's undeniably fatal injury. The weakened orc is overjoyed at the familiar sight of his savior, whom he addresses as Elder. He asks about the fate of the orc commander, hopeful that their leader safely escaped this wretched camp. The old orc speaks with evident grief in his words. He confides that all who escaped with him have been killed, including his only son. The Orc Commander, whom he buried in the old woods. Hey, Timo. No, we've encountered a new wood crisis, Orc unfortunately. A worse the one now. The injured Orc hands over a scroll, stolen from the prison warden's chambers. Finding peace in this final affront to his halfling captors, he closes his eyes as his heart ebbs into silence. That is a uh, poetic exit. Into fury. The prison warden must account for his vile acts. I aspire to such noble deaths. Reparino, buddy. All right. <laughs> That's a great way to honor him after such a noble fall. <laughs> Reparino, lol. Damn, those are good orbs, dude. Holy shit. A modest fortune. I probably should have brought the other orbs with me, too, I just realized. Oh, well. Plus 30% speed. Let's give that to a shaman, I say. Get the plus 5 life per attack. We'll throw that on to energetic. And then additional crit chance. We'll give that to... Yeah, I'll give that to you, too. Chance to crit on the uh, knockback move could be really nice. dance. Tempted to drop the freestyle London, yeah, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, so we've gone from fighting a ghoul with three zombies to just a single ghoul now, which is strange to me. This is conceivably gonna be much easier than the previous fight. I'm waiting for the for the other shoe to drop here. Just sort of wrecking him right now. You got a stun up for me? I got a life shock. I don't really need that though. 90 HP though. I'm pretty sure the other one had 90. Ow! Okay, that sucked. Don't do that. Ah, oh, whoops. There we go. Heal. You got a heal? You got a heal? Keep that bleed going. Life shot, life shot, life shot. Redraw. There it is. There it is. Yeah, the other fight was definitely tougher than this. It's very strange. Very good. Okay, bleeds are already sticking around. Lucky's gonna take a big chunk. That's fine. He's frozen. We'll be able to heal him, hopefully. 
just gonna die to the bleed here, Jesus. Stunned, we'll try to stall a little bit for one more life shock on these guys. There we go. Nice. That worked perfectly. I think it's the bare optimal. Finish the job. Excellent. Weapons sheathed, they trundle on. Yeah, that was, that was just weird. And it gives me nine healing items. Holy shit. Thank you. That's pretty terrific. Okay. Moving on. I ain't gonna fight it, dude. The goblins assemble to hunt this ruthless warden. Looks like this is the boss fight. They give pause at the looming appearance oh. of a malevolent white and shrouded in shadow. Oh boy. Slowly writhes forth, hunting the same quarry. He's right there. He's under the thing. Under He's the under the stage. Get him. Shadows, the sniveling warden mules for him. Mules, he says. The white, sensing the goblin's presence, abandons the halfling in favor of more suitable prey. Yeah, that's just straight up lifted from Lord of the Rings, right? <laughs> it's, it's actually a halfling, too. Hiding from the Dementor. Yeah, that, that, that felt very familiar. All right, let's do it. The Shadow White. Horde of the Woods. Nah, I think we're done with Dave, Mental Gen Z. Yeah, we, I, I had a good time with it, but... I think that, that'll be a... Uh, that'll be a... Uh, done deal on Dave for now. 250 hit points. Holy shit. Sorry, the, the what is it? Fuck. I lost all my nerd cred there, didn't I? What are they called? The um Ah, I remember. Now I just look like a damn fool. You know what I'm talking about. Nazgul, okay, I no wonder I didn't remember. I'm gonna keep calling them Dementors. Let's get the haste on the bleed, guys. This is bleed resist. It's pretty high. Maybe I shouldn't go that route. Could freeze him. He's pretty vulnerable to that. There we go. Bold attack. I really like. I like this freeze pose. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's good. That's effective. Oh, and another big crit. Nice. Curse of the Meek. And the Icy Touch. Okay, Curse of the Meek is going to give us... An enemy skull is summoned each time you use an ability that costs two or less. Interesting. Okay. You can probably avoid that. Drain life. Oh, that's not fun. The Curse of the Reckless. This dude's got action economy. Holy shit. Curse of the Reckless summons a skull each time you use an ability that costs three or more. Okay, I think you just replace the Curse of the Meek real quick, though, so that's fine. Let's keep hasting here. Or try to, anyway. Low chance to slow, I think. Um, I mean, I do need to deal damage. This is, this is very difficult to get by. I have a lot of potential to hit him very hard with these moves. Stun resist as well. Wakey wakey is an option here, right? Yeah, he does have the slow, I guess. Uh, I'm probably not going to bleed him, yeah. Alright. Oh, that well, okay. Okay, that's my first mistake there. I gotta pay attention. Exploding skull, too. Oh, boy. That's not good. Okay, yeah, I gotta pay more attention to that. Um. Oh, he's bleeding. Well, good. Okay. I wasn't expecting that, but I'll certainly take advantage. And that one's the reckless one, right? Yeah, so that was good that he did the two cosmos there. Oh, the bleed would be huge here. He is reckless. 
sadly does not have an option otherwise, so I guess we'll just go for it. Crit for 11, pretty nice. Skull, though. So the exploding, I am wondering uh, whether I should prioritize killing them first. Certainly doesn't feel like something I want to see the result of. Got to keep picking those wounds. Restore the bleed. There we go. Yeah, I suppose it makes sense that the bleed is capped at three because we can make quick work of this guy otherwise, probably. Still slowed, so Wakey Wakey still has the empowered ability, but I could also try to target this guy with it. Oh, I, uh, I don't think I had another option there that time, though. Ah, oh, God, that's... That's a big factor, isn't it? Okay. Let's see. Might be able to kill this guy before he gets his move off. Looks like it. And this is the reckless one, but he does... Uh, he's just going to summon a new guy. That's not good. Huh. Well, I mean, it's probably better at least to kill the one, but I know we're just summoning a full strength guy now. Uh, right. Huh. Yeah, this is going poorly. And I feel like he can just get as many skulls as he wants. Hmm. Oh, that was less effective that time. Okay, that's nice. This is not the reckless dude. I don't really need to heal here. Explosion still being put off for now. Not reckless. We could try to stun here, although it's fairly unlikely, but I think it's worth a go. Okay. The bleed's helping. The bleed's doing something. And yeah, he just doesn't have a choice here, unfortunately. Okay. Uh, let's just chop then, I guess. There's another skull. I think that might be max capacity. Oh, that's not that bad. Okay. Yeah, that's not awful. The fact that it hits everybody is pretty bad, but it's a, not, a, not a terrible amount of damage. It's just really unfortunate that I don't have a choice. I have to summon another skull with these guys. I assume he probably played around that, too. Yeah, there's really not an option here. <laughs> Just chilling there. <laughs> Sitting with his back to this. Alright, alright. Yeah, this is... I mean, it's not negligible, obviously. It's still kind of concerning, but it's not as bad as it could be. We're not summoning here, at least. Mm -hmm. And the life shock for Canadian. Go. Um, armor up? Yeah, I think it's about that time. I might even fully block the explosion, I just realized. That'd be pretty sick. Okay, hopefully that switch of the curse is enough to afford us the ability to actually do stuff here. I don't think that's gonna matter on this skull, sadly, if it were worth a shot at least, though. Okay. Go ahead and heal Bacon again. And that does not summon the skull, which is nice. Salvage is pretty solid here. Hey. Oh, right back at it, okay. That's fine with me. Could be worse. Alright, let's see here. I think we keep armor in, yeah, that'll work. We're in much better shape now. Canadian's all right. I'd love to get some more bleed going. I guess this is the way to do it. Excellent. Yeah, it's been uh, one of the few ways we can succeed here so far. Exterminate, not able to reach the back. I'm going to try to take this skull out before it blows us up again. He's got the meek, so if we do soul gale, we should be good, right? Yep, that'll do it. 
All right, sick. Much better shade now. Let's see here. He doesn't have the meek, so we can do whatever we want here. I think we'll uh, intercept, actually. I like that play a lot. Do, 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 do. Heal him up. I'm not super confident to begin this one, but now I'm feeling a lot better about it. Although the Curse of the Reckless is going to make things worse. Yeah, I was feeling better until that happened. Uh, that makes it more difficult. Uh, you're good to go, though, and you can chop. Send it. Sundered there. I don't know if that actually matters on this guy. I think his block is a different kind of block. All right, let's see if these guys even have an option here. Oh, that's getting worse, I think, which is really nice. It started off pretty good, but now it's not as good. Oh, I can actually do the pick wounds here to avoid the skull summon as well. That is perfect. And then, let's see here. I think a blast is still best. Let's do that. No froze, no, or no, fro no freeze that time. That's okay. Pick the wounds again. He also has Curse the Reckless, so that's perfect. Keep the leads going. Okay. And then, ooh, a haste is not a bad idea. Let's get a haste going on whoever does not have the curse. So we have to deal with that last, and we also have more ways to deal with the skulls if we have to bring them in. Well, you're getting low, though. We're going to need some heals from our shamans. Let's see. That's the meek, and there's no way to fight it, so I guess we'll just armor up there. Time to do it. Okay. They're very slow, though, so hopefully we can manage that. This is another meek, unfortunately, but that definitely feels like a way to go. There, get the bullets restored. Is it two or less, or is it three or less? It's two or less. Okay, so we actually do have options to combat that. Let's do exactly that. Okay. Halfway there. Like the soul gale again here. Crippling strike. Good stuff. Um, no option this time. I think we salvage that. Oh, goodness. He's in trouble here. These bleeds are gonna work eventually, right? Oh, his healing is twice as effective while he's got this. I didn't see that before either. Okay. We do the three cost rattle this time. Got the stun. Excellent. Uh, he's the meek, so we need to chop here. I didn't even exterminate, but eh, it's not that much better, I guess. There we go. Okay, got a skull up front. Good damage there, but also get the wakey wakey on this guy. I think I prefer that. Yeah, that's a good chunk. Okay, hopefully we can get a couple of heals going. It really doesn't want to let me do that, though. Sheesh. Let's just keep trying to knock him back. There's the heal, finally better there now. Okay, okay. Oh boy, yeah, this is getting really bad really fast. I don't want to pick wounds here. I'm just going to have to chop. That skelly's going to explode on us here too. For him to swap the curse for me, but I don't think he's gonna do it. He did! Well, thanks, bud. No, that's not too bad there for the drain life either. Okay. Curse of the Reckless opens up armor up for us. And then. Oh, he's gonna be forced though, goddammit. Alright, alright. Hopefully, we have better luck avoiding it now, though. Got a life shock as much as possible here. Gotta do it. Gotta do it. Keep him alive. Oh, what the hell? All right. It does give us fury, so that actually could help out. Might have needed that. Come on, guys. Come on now. We can do this. 
can heal for six, or we can just bash. I think we gotta go all in. No, you jerk! He's alive? He's alive. Drac, you hero. You legend. There may yet be hope. Oh, but that's another goddamn summon, isn't it? No, it's not. Nice. Freeze? No. Still a good chunk, though. Back to the curse of the meat. Another icy touch. Bacon! Still alive. Oh, shit. This injury deserves an answer. I think we need to... Ah, son of a bitch. He's just gonna blow up anyway. Yeah, that's a bummer, dude. I think he's gonna die to the explosion, too. That sucks. That's a double kill from the explosion? Oh, no. Most worthy cause. Oh, my goodness. It's coming down to the wire, dude. We're pretty pissed. Maybe that'll be enough. We get the slow. Oh, boy. Okay, okay, okay. Here's hoping. Here's hoping now. Stun as well. That's sick. We got the exterminate. For 17. We're getting there, dude. Maybe, just maybe. Give him the hex. Keep him slow. He's got an attack now. Oh, no, no, no! Oh, my God! Lucky! Stay lucky! Intercept? Or, sorry, not intercept. That's the... Uh... Oh, boy. There goes Orion. Still kicking. No way. Oh, Ryan. Oh, my God. Almost oh, my God. Clutch survival for the kill with the hex? So close. So close. Oh, no. Do we have to kill those skulls by the end of it, too? Oh, God. No! Come on, Len. Don't drain life. Oh, why? You motherfucker, you. Oh, boy. It's the one one. Oh, that summons a skull. Come on. Right, well, that's not going to be too bad, at least for him. He's still meek, so it's all about... Oh, God, it's all about the freaking... He has to get the, the rattle, or it's no go. Oh, never mind. There we go. At least if he's summoning skulls, he's not healing. I guess so. That's a good point. All right, two more bashes. Don't drain my life. Okay. I said specifically. Oh, you son of a bitch. I guess I shouldn't have really done armor up either. Yeah, because the armor doesn't do anything against these guys. Yeah, I think it's over, dude. Oh, especially if he's going to do that. God damn it. Well... Do our damnedest. That's fine. Uh, I can't. I, he, he's outpacing me now, dude. It's, uh, I think it's over. Uh, if I get stuns, maybe. But even then, it's not going to be enough. He's too fast. He's too fucking fast. Yeah, he's just draining life and icy touch. I can't do it. I got so close, man. That sucks. That sucks. Man. After all that, it's a full freaking party wipe. Now he's just drawing it out to taunt me. I mean, it just hurt my feelings. It's very rude. Clutch. Clutching it up. I'll do it. God damn it. Almost worthy. It is but a small setback think nothing more of it. All right. Well, that's something to shoot for next time, I guess. An obstacle to overcome. And that's a bunch of souls, right? There's always the silver lining. It's a bunch of souls. Yay! I love when all my goblins die. New day dawns. Oh, well. Guess that halfling's dead now. Uh, no, he was, he was hiding. He had his back to us. If he can't see us, we can't see him. You know how it works. Right, anyway. That'll do for Goblin Stone today, y'all. Thanks for watching. 
Appreciate y'all's support on this one. Still leave a like on the video as well. On YouTube, if you appreciate it over there, I certainly appreciate you watching. Thanks for being here. I'll see you next time.